As the name suggests, the template DNA strand serves as a template for the pairing of free ribonucleotides from the nucleoplasm via complementary base pairing. One thing to take note here is the differences in the nitrogenous bases of deoxyribonucleotide and that of ribonucleotides. The bases found in DNA are adenine, guanine, cytosine, and thymine, while the bases found in RNA are adenine, guanine, cytosine, and uracil. Note that thymine is only found in DNA, while uracil is only found in RNA. Thus, in complementary base pairing, A on the DNA strand will be paired with U, while T on the DNA template strand will be paired with A. RNA polymerase will then catalyze the joining of adjacent ribonucleotides through the formation of covalent phosphodiester bonds. The mRNA is synthesized and elongated in a 5' to 3' direction. As RNA polymerase moves in the 3' to 5' direction along the DNA tented strand, it continues to separate the two DNA strands and catalyze the assembly of ribonucleotides via complementary base pairing. Parts of the DNA that has just been transcribed reannews to reform a double helix.